I'm worrying about nothing. I need to go to the shops. I'll be. Whoa! Oh my word! That scared the niblets out of me. and welcome to today's vlog. Slightly later start than normal today. It's just gone lunchtime. Um, today, th this whole week has been messed up by wrestling. I'm such a child, but the re <laughs> I can't even believe I'm talking about this on the vlog. I'll be quick. Wrestling used to be out on a Monday and Tuesday night in America. It's now Monday, Wednesday, Friday. WWE have changed the days they release one of their shows, plus there's a new company that started. What that means for me and my working day is I normally have, I have my bit, sad as it might seem, I have my week built around being able to watch that stuff while I'm doing videos at certain times and doing editing and stuff. So I usually watch wrestling Tuesday and Wednesday morning. Yesterday, didn't watch any wrestling because there wasn't any. Got loads of work done, got ahead. Today, there was two wrestling shows to watch, which kind of put me behind all day. And now I've got one more video to make. I don't have enough time to do it because I still need to nip to the shops before Andy gets home. And uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm a little bit, it's not that I've got more work to do. It's not that I'm behind on work. And it's not that I sit there watching wrestling and not working. It's there on while I'm working, but obviously I can't watch TV whilst recording i can only do it whilst editing and it's kind of i need to adjust the shape of my week a little bit it's just a routine thing i'm ha i've had a hissy fit because my routine has been changed and i don't care for it um and i've worried i'm worried i'm not gonna get the videos i need for this weekend recorded in time but i'm worrying about nothing i need to go to the shops i'll be Whoa! oh my word that scared the niblets out of me. It vibrated and started talking at the same time. I need to turn that setting off on my watch. I genuinely thought someone had just walked in and started talking to me. I'm on edge because of these routine changes. I need to go to the shops. I need to calm down. I need to get on with some work. I've still got that games night video to edit. <sighs> Two and a bit hours later and I've calmed down a little. <laughs> um, I kind of wish I didn't have to leave that previous bit in, but the reaction to the watch was, Funny, so I've got you now. Apologies, negativity be gone. Um, I went to the shops, had a bit of lunch, took Dave out, just generally chilled out. I've done no more work, just chilling out. Andy's home in a few minutes, and I'm gonna sit down and get on with editing a video for him, because he needs it for Andy's eyes video, and also the, uh, the games night video. I'm gonna carry on with that, which at last count was about 35 minutes long. So needs a, still needs a lot of trimming, but I feel much better and happier now. Just needed to get out and get some fresh air, clearly. And Andy's home. Say hello, Andy. Hello. Have you had a good day at school? Yeah, I played flower game. You did what? There's some flower decided some flower game. Oh, oh, you want me to... For a minute there, I thought he was telling me what he'd done at school, but he was actually telling me he's recorded himself playing flower on PS4 and wants me to put it on his channel. Um, but there's about eight other videos in the queue before that. I think I should, I'm just about to edit together the final part of Belgium. And then I think we've got his trip to Cambridge. Final. Then Centre Parks, then Flower. So we're getting there. I'm getting through them slowly but surely. But I thought he was actually telling us a little bit about his day. I have had his email through from school. His TA is back in now. Um, his normal TA who sends the email out to us each day. He's been off sick for a little while. Um, but they're now back. Um, so... You went to the sensory room today? Yeah. Was that good? Mm -hmm. I'm really up for conversation today, as you can see. It's impossible to get him in the shop with me now as well without mm -hmm. putting the camera all the way up there. It's tied behind his computer, which, by the way, as you can see, fixed from yesterday. Um, it took hours last night to apply all the updates and things to get that up and running, but we got there in the end. Um, he did go to the sensory room. He did some good literacy work. Apparently, they're reading a book called Ma The Making of Milton. That means anything to anybody i've never heard of it but that's what they're reading at school dave no dave's trying to climb on me now because he knows i'm distracted because i've got the camera in my hand get down he was curled up and sleeping nicely until uh until i picked up the camera and started talking because i'm talking in that direction i think he thinks i'm talking at him plus the camera's in my hand so he wants to come over and say hello and um, he also did some artwork because they had to cancel football this afternoon it doesn't say why they cancelled football but they cancelled football, which he has been enjoying recently. He played a full match of football at school. 
two weeks ago, I think, which was the first time he'd ever done it. We bought him loads of football kit and stuff. So it's a bit of a shame that that was cancelled, but he's done art instead. I mean, it sounds like he's had a good day. He certainly seems in a better mood now than he was in last night when he went to bed very distressed because of this thing, which, oh, like fingers green, crossed, green colour. should green. be all good now. This is the first time he's had it back since last night and it doesn't sound like he's having the same problems with it he was having before. It's difficult to know exactly what the issue was because he won't let me watch over his shoulder and see what he's doing. So I have to kind of go in afterwards and see what he's been up to, look at his search history and his downloads history and all that kind of stuff and kind of figure out what's actually happened. But he's not doing the constant clicking that he was doing yesterday, which is when he was closing all these pop-ups. So at least they're gone and he seems happy enough. So I think we are all sorted. But I need to get on with editing together this through Andy's eyes video or it is not going to get flower. out today. It's not going to be flower today. It's going to be the last Belgian one. Assuming he didn't do loads on the last day. I say the last one. I haven't actually looked how much footage we've got. Fingers crossed it's the last one from Belgium because we really need to move on from that now and get on with some of this other stuff. As you can see it's later in the day. We now have an Anna back in the house who is very tired. Yeah! She's had a, we also have one of those that you can hear the other side of the camera. You've had a very long day, haven't you? Oh, it's half, three now, Andy. It's half three this morning you got up. Wow. Um, so you're quite tired now. Do you want to show everybody your shiny new shoes? <laughs> well, they're not shiny. They're the opposite of shiny. These are Anna's. No, Dave! These are Anna's new oh, waterproof is... shoes that are currently being wow, fanned by Dave. These are waterproof yeah, trainer style Uggs. Mm. Is yeah. that right? So they're a combination of comfortable and waterproof and warm. Yeah, because I've got these. In preparation. At the moment. <laughs> yeah, they're your sketches, aren't they? Yeah. They're to get you ready for Goose Fair on Saturday. I'm just going out in the winter. But mainly Goose Fair, yeah, which he dying, dying. is ready to go to. However, that's all we've heard this evening. Because he knows we're going to Nottingham, we are not going to the windmill, we are going to Goose Fair. He is convinced rides. that while we're there, All we can rides. just drop in and spend the day at the windmill. Eight rides. Are we going to watch the sun go down and look at the lights? Yeah. And go on the tram? So just what, what do you want to go on? Home. How many rides? Ten. You want to go on ten? Ten rides. rides. Then dinner. Ten <laughs> rides, then dinner. What, and then are we... Nice then tea time at the fair watcher. Well, perhaps we need to go a little earlier then, because... Oh, I... Yeah, we'll see, see Lewis, definitely, he's going to be there. Our plan usually, because he really likes to sit on, there's a bench at the top of the hill that looks over the, the fair and you can see all the lights and stuff from up there. And our usual plan is to get there like half an hour before the sun goes down, let him do a quick lap, have a look, then get up on that hill so he can watch everything, then we do rides afterwards. Oh, just so the box knows. These have 63% off. I don't need to know that. <laughs> <laughs> see, what you, see what you've done to Anna with all your, with all your comments. Like, I'm, I'm only talking to the mean ones. Money. All but these comments lately about us wasting money. Very good price. You don't need to justify buying a pair yeah, of shoes. Yeah. You are an adult who earns her own money. Um, contrary to the comment that I tweeted out this morning, I didn't send you to work yes, at car. <laughs> <laughs> Anna is able to make her own decisions. She earns her own money. Send me to work. And she can, people will believe that. And she can spend that money on whatever she pleases. Yeah, and she's bought herself a pair of shoes, which is completely fine. In fact, it's better than fine because I would rather she had a nice pair of shoes that's going to keep her feet warm and dry than the alternative, which is we have an extra, I don't know. 40 quid <laughs> knocking around in her bank account that I'm not going to see anyway. Yeah. Um, but she spends all Saturday night on the way home moaning about how cold and wet her shoes are because she's walked around a muddy field in a pair of trainers that she's then ruined and would have to pay to replace I anyway. Like we don't have to justify spending money. We're allowed to spend money. These are the Chinese but I love Uggs. Uggs. So I haven't Uggs. seen you in a pair of Uggs for years. I when I first met her, it's all she wore. And then I made a comment about, I just thought these were for chabs. <laughs> I, yeah, them. I didn't know. Until she was looking at these, I didn't know that's why she'd stopped wearing them. Because I didn't mean I don't like them. I was just a little <laughs> bit surprised that people wore them. Because in my circle, it's not the kind of thing people wear. I don't, I don't know, I don't, no, I do. don't look at her feet. So I didn't realise Anna had spent the last six years not wearing the shoes she likes because of a throwaway comment that I said not long after we met.
but she's now fully back on the Uggs yes. wagon. They're waterproof. Yeah, that is quite impressive, waterproof Uggs. Andy, what are you doing? What are you doing? I think he's tired. He is tired. He's been getting up really early this week and it's weird because we always thought the issue of getting up early was to do with the sun coming up but it Be seems male. like he was, he was quite good with it over the summer he wasn't oh. getting up mega early very often and when he did we thought it's just because oh, he's Be not male. done much today and it's the sun is up and stuff we thought <laughs> back to school and darker mornings we thought that would mean sort the sleep out and it seems to have had the opposite effect okay yeah he seems to have got himself into a routine of, yeah. he, he, don't, he never stays up late he always goes to bed at the same time because he just he's passing out on the chair Lovely. if we try and keep him up past eight o'clock but he's going through this thing where he'll have he'll maybe one two three Daddy. days in a row where he wakes up mega mega early there was one night like in the last week or so where I was going to bed at like half past 12 at night and he was already getting up and I had to send him back to bed but he'll get up really mega early for a few days in a row yeah and then lie in and he seems to have got himself if he's not mega tired he'll get up super early and then he'll get to the point where he's mega tired and sleep in and not be able to not be able to wake himself up but I think it's because now he's back at school he's got less time to do stuff like what he's doing now at home so he's not able to fit in all of the stuff he wants to do on his laptop and on his ipad and all this other stuff so i think he's deliberately waking himself up in the middle of the night to get his stuff done while he's fully awake because he knows he's tired in the evenings yeah well the laptop's sorted now he's already been using that since he's got home Although it's odd, he's not used it much. It's back on his iPad. I don't think he fully oh, trusts it again yet. The other day, Monday, I got an, a thing, an email. Um, his things will be back within 10 days. What is DS? It's taken a while. Because yeah. they said I sent it and it would take 10 days. I've sent it and then waited a week and a half and now it's 10 days. Can I just point out the whole time we've been doing this clip? It looks like you're about to watch a Zoella with video. When did she rename herself to Zoe Sug rather than Zoella? That's Yeah, Anna is not about to watch a Zoella video. However, Marcus Brownlee, I'll happily watch one of his videos because he's awesome. But we are going to end the vlog here because I'm going to be streaming tonight. It's nearly half past seven. Um, Anna's going to pass out in bed once Andy's had his bath, so I am going to take advantage of that fact and go out and do a little bit of streaming so we'll end the vlog there if you have enjoyed it please make sure you leave a nice big thumbs up on there for us Su <laughs> subscribe to the channel for more daily vlogs it, i guess this is coming out on friday so if you are going to be at goose fair on saturday in nottingham keep an eye out for us because we're going to be there too there will be no cash in the attic um, and thank you very much for watching yeah.